Welcome to Emma Graphics Channel. Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel with your boy Emma Graphics. If you are new here, consider subscribing and then click on the notification bell to get notified whenever I post any video. So today I'm going to teach you how to design a party flyer with PZL app. So let's get started. Firstly, I'm going to delete this as usual and then come to my import. Then to my um, download and then import this background. So I'm going to be dropping the link of all this background in the description so you can download it and use it, and use it for them. For, for your own design also so after importing this you import the second background okay this and then and then I increase the cell and then lock it also and then Come to my test, edit, edit, delete this, and, and type Puna Hotel and Bar Capitulator and then, oh, sorry, Puna Hotel and Bar Capitulator. Okay and then centralize it and then uh, come to your font the font we are using is called Montserrat semi boot and then reduce the size centralize it and bring it down a little bit you can see it's too um, this background, um, this background is uh, the lighting effect is too much. So what I'm going to do to make this visible, I'm going to give it a shadow, a shadow, like just like this. So we are good to do. And then I copy it. Okay, before copying it, let me just delete this. Come to your spacing, space it a little bit, and then. Centralize it like this and then copy it and then edit, delete this, and then present capital letter. Okay, centralize it and then bring it down a little bit. So then come to your import to your download and then I Click on this, okay, and then increase it a little bit and then bring it here. So, after that, come to my test and then edit. Then click on edit and type truck capital letter and then come to your test. The font I'm using for this is called a Veltica. Let me show you. A Veltica in Serat. And then increase the size like this. Bring it here. Also increase the size of this lady here. And then I include the size of this also. And then come to my color gradient. Okay, let me just type, let me copy it again. And then, and then click on edit and type Fridays. Capital letter and then. I make it align like this and then reduce the size make it align also just like this and then bring it down 
a little bit and then give this a color i'm giving it a gradient color look at so this is it this is a white color and for this is a pink color look at the number you can write it here if you like and then draw a come to your shape draw a shape like this okay and then give it the color here is the blue color i'm giving it and then bring this down to here you can see and i'm going to log this because i want to work on this shape and then i bring it down a little bit click on the fridays and then also bring it down so you are good to go and i'm going to lock i'm going to lock this okay so after that after that we are going to write our dates date and time 30 2022 okay bring this here and bring it down a little bit so the font i'm using for this is called Montserrat you can see Montserrat black and then going to include the side a little bit like this then come to your test edit January capital letter also bring it here okay click on the January and then change the font to Montserrat semi bold and then reduce the size make it align with it with the dates reduce it like this okay then you draw a line come to your shape draw a line like this Just like this click on it and then bring it down so after that click on this again then you copy it and also bring it here bring it here and then click on edit now your clock PM. Okay. So bring it. It's too big. I'm going to reduce it and then bring it to make it align with this and then copy this again. Bring it to the middle. Position it very well. okay to make it fast and then click on sorry click on edit prompt up to later and then increase the size let me just leave it let me reduce the size of the nine o'clock a little bit So you have to work on this okay so we are good to go and after that i'm going to come to my import from 
come to where I save it with file and then import the location the location logo the location icon I mean put it somewhere here come to your uh, import again okay I'm gonna I'm going to import this we are not using this for now but I'm just going to leave it somewhere here and come to my import again and then come to my download and import the date and time icon date and time icon okay this is it and then you remove the background by coming to your UVS color and then enable it and then after that you use the size and then come to your position and bring it here okay and then give it the color this color so after that click on this and then also bring it here then copy then click on this copy it bring it here and then write 42 kj root lagos capital letter okay reduce the size and then bring it here so this time around okay let me just bring it here bring it here okay click on this 30 this date come to your shadow let's give it an effect okay enable it and then give it this color okay let me just increase the blow a little bit to 11 you can see it's shining a little bit okay so after that so now we are coming to the DJs so for this come to your shape like this then the opacity of the shape I'm going to reduce it to zero and then give it a stroke width to two and then give it a white color give the stroke with a white color you can see this is the stroke color look at stroke color yeah stroke color so below the below the stroke color i'm going to see all this and then give it the white color so i'm going to reduce the stroke width to four, to four and then scale it like this then bring it here like this then after that i'm going to type the the dj's names just copy this like this and then edit so after typing it to give it a capsule turn into capsule letter and then bring it inside this bus and then make it fit so then i bring this here give the side a little bit bring it here and then copy this edit straight by reservations capital letter then bring it here so you come to your align and then give it a right alignment like this so i'm going to bring it up a little bit like this then after that after that i'm going to position this very well okay so we are good to go we are done with the particular you can see it's very nice so kindly subscribe to my channel and don't forget to, don't forget to click on the 
notification bell to get notified whenever I post a new video. Thank you. See you in my next video. Bye.